Welcome back to PES Blog. Today I'll be explaining about PESAT, the official exam of PES. So I'll start off by explaining about the format, then we'd move on to the date, and at the end we have a few special guests to answer your questions. So stay tuned till the end. So starting on on the format, PESAT is like any other entrance exam that you've written, I guess. It's conducted in CBT mode. It's a three hour long paper with about 180 questions. There are 60 physics, 60 math, 40 chemistry, and about 20 English questions. And the level of the paper would be a bit above your KCT level and a bit below your JEE mains level papers. The physics and chemistry questions are pretty simple according to me at least. Like it's all your formula based questions. The math questions are pretty lengthy like your section formula, finding out the volume of parallelopiped, integra integration etc. The English questions I would recommend you to go through the sample paper because that's the level they keep for that year. I think your ICSC or ISE preparation should be enough for that. Otherwise, go through your Bitsat Arihan series, which is also pretty helpful. And coming to, if you're searching for papers in PESAT, I'm sorry to disappoint. There are none available. You just have to go through their mock papers or the sample papers that are on their website. Hmm, okay. Yeah, hey, guys, uh, today we have some special guests to answer the questions you've been asking about PESAT. Uh, guys, do you want to introduce yourself? Um, hi everyone, I'm Kumaro Manu and I'm in first year uh, computer science. Um, this is Keerthi and I'm in first year computer science too. Okay, fine. This is Kavisha Masur and I'm from CSE. Hey guys, this is Martini Krishnamurthy and I'm from computer science. How did you guys prepare for PESAT? I don't think any one of us prepared for PESAT in like, like specifically. It was it was it was more of like JE prep and we wrote PESAT in the floor. And you and you don't even get like old question papers or anything of that sort. So it was it was it was more of just JE prep and then use that to write the questions with. Okay, is there anything specific that could have helped you in PESAT or like Anything you found similar, like your um, chemistry from NCRT um, or um, no, specific chemistry, things? chemistry, chemistry has always been in been the NCRT, but like PESAT has a, a English section, so I feel like that was that was that was one part where, you know, you could have scored easy marks if if, if people had paid attention to that. Okay. Yeah. So moving on, Kirti, same question passed. Yeah. Yeah, so uh, since the syllabus was same um, to that of uh, JE, it didn't really need any extra separation. Um, so I, I just uh, mainly went through my class notes from my coaching class and like important questions. Uh, the only extra thing would be again the English section, which uh, you can manage if you know basic um, phenomena and anatomy and all of that. Uh, the official PES website had some um, sample questions, which uh, which gives you an idea about how you can, like how what type of questions are going to come and all that. So, yeah. Yeah, honestly, I have nothing more to add to that. It was the same thing because we were preparing for all the exams, KCT, Comet K, J, everything. And uh, the level of PESAT is almost similar to uh, KCT and Comet K. Uh, again, as I said, the extra English section that you could go through. And uh, since there's nothing else to uh, refer to, uh, I just went through the formulas three days uh, prior to the main exam. And yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> Yeah, and I also think that um, the other competitive exams like Manipal and also the entrances happened slightly before PESAT, so that helped the PESAT preparation a little bit. So, otherwise, it's the same thing as other people said. Uh, so, how was your experience writing PESAT, the three hour long exam? So, um, yeah, as, as Mathangi said, we had, we had a couple of exams before PESAT. So we actually were in the flow of giving exams continuously because like Manipal happened and then Comet K K C T happened. So so we so we were used to the whole three hour format. Um the way the way the exam was conducted with, 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 with all the COVID protocols was was um, appreciable because 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 that time it was really the peak of COVID and um, and all of us were genuinely scared to like give exams because we had seen what had happened in previous exams such as KCT and Comet, where, um, such where because because these exams are conducted by the government, so there weren't that many protocols that were taken care of. But like since, since it's a private institution, um, um, all the protocols were taken care of. 
um the exam procedure and and writing the exam was was quite smooth apart from few technical difficulties like the calculator which was somewhat tedious to use during the exam and um yeah i feel like i feel like they they, they maintained social distancing we all we all were given pretty we need classrooms to give our exam so all in all it was a pretty good experience so yeah kirti do you have anything yeah. to add on yeah the exam per se was uh, quite chill you could figure out most of the questions within 30 to 40 seconds so i feel that's about it okay uh, is there anything you'd like to add on the time management of like how you manage your english because that's a new section compared to the previous exams so like how do you do your time uh, management usually yeah usually i go through all the questions once and leave the questions which are going to take a lot of time for later because i might not be able to figure that out so yeah, english i finish it first because um, it hardly takes any time and then i came to uh, physics chemistry and yeah. like while writing the exam there were a lot of because it's a computer based exam and the questions were picked randomly a lot of the questions at least in my paper they were repeated and um again the difficulty varies from paper to paper no one had the same paper so what i had heard from the people who had already given the exam was that it's a very easy paper but uh, the day i went to write an exam it was a relatively harder paper but i think once you um, uh, once the ranks come according to the relative markings uh, then your uh, marks and ranks i think kind of neutralize and overall the paper was was yeah i mean Go, do the section that you think you're best at first and yeah that's all so the experience was pretty peaceful except that we had to wear a mask and write and it was the first of the kind that of the exams that we wrote offline so it was kind of hard to breathe but otherwise it was pretty okay and chill so like the difficulty level was also fine so so would you guys like to give any tips to the people who are writing passat this year come on tips as such um i'll just say now with no with now that now that covid is rising again just just be safe don't don't um like even if you like whenever you come to write the exam as well don't don't like hang around in big crowds give your exam go home um and i don't have to say study well because everyone is studying well <laughs> even though they're bored of the exams now but just just study well don't stress write what you know and you'll be fine Yeah, I I don't think I have anything to add on to that. You guys, uh, just give your best and do it. All the best. Uh, Pesat has more questions than uh, the other exams that we'll be writing, so I think time management and uh, most of the questions I think like. Uh, a majority of the questions are formula based so i think uh, if you know the formulas you don't need to go in depth uh, for the concepts in pesat at least now yeah, that's all uh i would like to add that um, if you don't get in the first round don't be disappointed there's one more round you can try in that because most many people got in the second round they didn't get in the first round so don't lose hope if you don't get in the first round okay now coming on to the date pesat is scheduled this year between june 18th and july 4th and this is a tentative date it may be rescheduled due to the rising cases and i guess that's about for the date for now stay tuned we'll update you further if there are any changes and if you guys have any other doubts related to pesat or like you have any other queries that you feel necessary feel free to send us a comment or dm us on our insta page and my last message for you guys is stay safe and strong during these tough times give it your all for the exams and i hope you all crack them easily thank you